Yeah. I would die for Adrian Smith. You heard it here. And the, um, but the, um, but I would say, I would die for Adrian Adrian Smith. Smith. Um, So what's on the docket today? Um, you getting the uh, the noodles out of your uh, beard? You don't tell me. What definitely on the docket. Saving it for later. I mean, listen, Iron Maiden is one of the most influential bands on the face Thank of the you. planet, no matter what. Like, no matter how you slice it, Iron right. Maiden is like without radio airplay, has been able to reach more people than bands with radio airplay are capable of doing. Exactly. Mm-hmm. That That's being good. said. You know, uh, that being said, I think it's really interesting. It's like, obviously, when you and I, we, we talk about our favorite Maiden records and stuff like that, we always come back to talking about the, the classic shit. I think it's always overstated via classic Maiden records. Like, I think that they're oftentimes over-discussed when there's such, like, when there's a second half of Maiden's catalog that I think is just as strong. I mean, you've got, I mean, if you look at it, you've got, you know, the, uh, the, the Paul era. So, you know, the first couple, you have... Bruce era one, and then you've got you know the Blaze era, and then you yeah, have like Bruce the, era whatever. two. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, and I think you know listening to the the albums in succession that there's this. I mean, it, it, it's kind of like their own roller coaster. But- when most people compare Maiden, right? We kind of get lost, like, you know, I, you kind of get well, lost. Because the they with, yeah, this. yeah, right. So um, I think people do compare like the peaks of Maiden, right? There are two clear high points in Maiden's career and they were both of Bruce. Oh, sorry. Do people not compare those two eras you think are those because those to me are the people are like, do you like new Bruce or old Bruce? No, that is to be the conversation. There's a key ingredient you're missing is Adrian Smith. Yep. He is such a strong songwriter. It, I, I think if Bruce came back to the band without Adrian, they would have, they would not no, be what they are. They I don't disagree. Be, yeah, I would die for Adrian Smith. You heard it here. And the um, but the um, but I would say Dang, I would die. <laughs> I would die Smith. for Adrian Smith. Um, I think that you know going back to the initial point, I think that we discuss so much of those early Bruce records. Like, I don't ever hear anybody say, hey, what's your favorite record from, you know, that post that that uh, 2000s Iron Maiden era? I don't ever people talk Brave about that. Brave yeah, New yeah. World? Brave New World? I I think all time. Although Dance of Death is is a very close second for me. Yeah. I, well, is it because of like that, like that sort of, I would say, like emotional relationship that you have to Brave New World, that experience that you had going to go oh, by I'm sure your day? I'm sure that's 100%. Yeah, I'm yeah sure that's, that's how Maiden works. Because... Because, you know, my favorite band from back in the day were finally whole again. My favorite Bruce returning album is The Final Frontier. It is, I love the prog elements. They really dove into the Rush yeah. influences on that one. And that, that could be just me. That album is my favorite out of all. Oh, of I will. So Final Mother Frontier is, yeah, Final Frontier yeah. is my favorite. And uh, I think it's for similar reasons that Brave New World is yours. Final Frontier was... That was oh. my first ma- that was my first maiden concert. That was my first like the first time w- uh. one of my favorite bands ever was releasing a record when I was alive, you know, um, or at least when I was conscious of their music. Oh, you see back in my yeah. day. <laughs> so and then seeing them live, like it was just a that whole album was just mm-hmm. like a huge experience for me. Do we just leave and not tell Justin? We could, it'd be fun. And we could even edit on that note where I'm just going to leave and just let it be him. Sounds good. Awesome. All right. All right. Just... <laughs> See ya. You guys done?